Screechings from the Lens of Chaos. I'm Saif, and I'm redoing a thing I started to do, but various reasons are causing me to restart again. So let's just get started. So I am playing uh, Legend of Zelda, um, or Queen of Time Randomizer. And there's a specific reason I'm redoing the, the thing I've already started. And that is because, you know those random things where it's just like, a dumb claim comes out of nowhere? From a third party who doesn't even own the material that they're trying to claim from your video. Yeah, that, 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 was, that, that was the thing. So I'm just gonna grab these four chests. Uh, the sword chest is a waste of time because it's just, um, it freezes you. The Deku Tree's keys, not keys, um, items aren't that worth getting at the moment. So we received a dungeon map, a key for G2G, um, I assume another key of sorts. Anyway, we're just gonna leave, get a heart piece. Yeah, at least redoing this, I can actually um, formulate a better plan on how I'm going to do this. This is basically Curse of the Blue Pea. Most of the items I've picked up thus far, minus a few of them, have been, like, blue rupees. Uh, I would go to Lon Lon Ranch, but the item there, at least a heart piece, is a blue pea. So, yeah. I'm using version 5 of the randomizer, so... Don't you peep at me. Anyway. Yeah, I want to get onto the other side of the river, actually. I think this is the fastest way you can get over here. There's a few things I want to collect before we, uh... Well, get to where we were before. I am going to add music in and post mostly YouTube audio library stuff. It's unfortunate that, like, things keep happening like that. Because, yeah. So, first thing I want to do is go up this ladder. The entrance to Death Mountain is closed off, so we can't do that. Uh, the heart piece in Impus Hut is a blue pea. I mean, I would go get it, but I'm in no rush for money right at the moment. I'm gonna talk to this guy on the roof. Because he's part of the logic. So it's the chess minigames, uh, victory item. <laughs> Gonna go into this grotto. Gonna grab this chest, which is actually something very useful. So yeah, instantly Orcarina. This is one of the things I did during my second part, but was unable to continue because at that point I realized that that third party uh, claim came in randomly. So that's actually kind of annoying. And it was during a part where I was in the storage room of the, the castle town. So, yeah. I'm gonna borrow this chicken for a little bit longer. Uh, okay, I just need to go around. Yeah, so hopefully this goes way better than last time. I kind of know a few things, but that's also because...
prisons. I gotta save all the cuckoos. The item you get from her is actually pretty decent. Where do those other chickens go? Don't tell me they reset. Well, that's annoying. Looks like I have to go up there again. Come on. Don't forget about the one near the entrance. I mean, I would, like, speed this up and cut it out or stuff, but... At the same time, I was doing mediocre tasks during the last time I attempted this. And yes, I meant to do this at some point. Mostly when, um... Things, uh, calmed down. But I never expected the... The random... I'm, I'm just gonna go on about that. I don't even know. Because... It wasn't that bad. It was a claim. It wasn't like a, a strike. So... I'm overreacting just a little bit. But at the same time, I didn't feel like having that be like that. Because it's just... I don't know. It just kind of annoys me when it, that stuff kind of happens. Especially for content that's actually not in a video. I would bring up the page, but kind of just annihilated the video when it was posted. I'm just like, yeah, no. So yeah, there's not much I probably could do at the moment, otherwise. Made from glass, it's a heart container. Alright, so I should also mention that I'm using a tracker. Well, more for editing. So, if the tracker doesn't update right away, it means I kind of forgot. So... Yeah, there's nothing I can do in this area at the moment. Uh, I think I need more rupees before I try and do anything else. So we'll try and get to the castle town before night. I know walking backwards would be faster, but at the same time, it's one of those situations where walking backwards also kind of like... throws you off a little bit. I mean, eventually I want it to be night so I can grab a few things. Alright, so I'm gonna go in here. And yeah. It was the shop's theme. I was playing with the random music on. And... And yeah, the, the shop's theme triggered for some random song that, you know, yeah, it's a token, but at the same time, tokens are useful. But for now, we'll just ignore that. During my original run, I only got, like, five tokens? Yeah, I don't have any... funds to, like, go buy stuff. This is probably the worst item that... I've gotten. Mostly because it's condescending as hell.
and I want to kill you, spider. Nope, miss. Miss. I don't think you can hit it with the rocks. Oh well. I'll come back to this later. When I have sticks. That's like the biggest thing is... Okay, I can do this as well. Follow me. I mean, I didn't do this last time. Mostly because uh, I never thought about it. Well, I did. But it was more of a sense of... I didn't want to do it at the time, and it was never nighttime in town. And this is one of those things where you just grab a random dog and hope it's the one the person's looking for. I mean, I'm just gonna grab this, you know, because... How about you? Oh no, another dog's following me. Fair enough. Or not. You gonna follow? Okay, good. Just making sure you're still following. Like, this also takes a lot of time. I ditched a lot of stuff in the original because... Oh. So, if I came this way, I would have gotten the bow. Is it... it okay, fine. Yeah. I guess I kind of glanced over a few things. Just more of a sense of... Yeah, it's... I think it was mostly because I was kind of upset that most of the items I've been getting from this were, like, rupees. Speaking of rupees... I'm just gonna grab the Master Sword. At least this song's still in. And we should be good otherwise. Yeah, so bow, ocarina, which is not bad. 20 rupees. Now I'm going to go to Kakariko Village again. Hopefully I find all, like, appropriate music for this. I kind of still wanted to run the music, but if it's gonna, like, randomly be triggered for no reason, then I'm not gonna worry about it. And at least version 5 at least allows you to cut out the songs. Oh yeah, and Another note is I'm not really using Shop Sanity, so... Oh, it's nighttime. Nah, that's fine. Is it? I mean, the thing I want to do in Kakariko doesn't require it to be daytime anyway, so... I 
I mean, I could have also gotten another item beforehand. But that was also 20 rupees. But at the same time, I probably do want it right now. I could also do the bomb minigame now. If you think about that, it's just kind of one of those things where you didn't have this last time, so it's just nice to have it now. Ow. So I'm going to go grab the... Well, I could also come back here during... <laughs> kind of, I have more information than I did last time I started this, because I was reminded of uh, things I could be doing. That's a bundle of arrows? Ah, uh, I kind of wanted the... I think it was a... I guess it's because I have the bow, and it's just like, yep, yeah, uh, we're gonna replace this, whatever this item was. I think it was like 20 rupees. With like, the appropriate item, now that you have the bow. And I guess that's okay. Alright, what I wanna do is get on top of this now, so I can get the bombs. This area sounds weird without music. You can actually hear the ambience of the thing turning. Yeah. And of course, we do have the Arcarina, so we can also bug him. But I do want to grab this. Which will give us bombs. And having bombs is nice. I mean, we're required to play the, uh... Song of Storms, of all things. Even though we don't have... We won't get the Song of Storms from this. But we will get the Goron Tunic. So we can go into Death Mountain if we really wanted to. I'm not going to worry about it right now, but yeah, we can go into Death Mountain if we really feel like it. But I will have to pass some time and then come back. Because there are a few items. Okay, one item. I really want, because it'll open another area for us. Especially if we decide to go back to the Temple of Time. Grab that out of the way. It is a token, but... Again, tokens also lead to other prizes as well, so... There's another one up there. Gets hit by rock. Alright, it's daytime for when we go back to the village. So I want to grab this chest. Which is a piece of heart. Okay. Kind of forgot about that. Then again, I never really made it here the last time, mostly because I was like, what do I do? I don't have anything. All I'm getting are blue piece. And of course, this kind of kills the, uh, the run title, which was Curse of the Blue Pea. Of course, I'm also have to come back here later as well. Which 
actually. I'm wasting bombs on purpose. be nice if I could actually, like, throw it and it, like, hit something from a distance. Ow. Right, there's nothing over here. Again, not too worried about bombs. Because I'm going to open this. And I'm going to get the hook shot. And pretty much this is where I ended my second part. So I'm doing really well so far. Uh, in the second chest there, I'm going to leave it alone. Mostly because I don't need whatever's in the chest. Okay, it is there. I'll also bomb this open. Well, that didn't work. Can I get it from here? No, it's too short. Where, where did I shoot it from last time? Uh, no. Although that would have been amazing if the, a certain thing was in range. Oh, come on. Okay, where did I hit this from last time? Not here, obviously. Uh, another thing I could do here is break these pots. Get items I don't need. Because at least one of these, um... Maybe from down here? No, I think I would be in a worse position. No, I can hit it. I can hit the target from there. Maybe I did do it from at least one level lower. So yeah, let's get rid of you. Robert. I guess that works in a way, but this is why I wasn't too worried about wasting bombs. Alright, so that's dealt with. So we have bombs, we have arrows, we have a grappling hook. Which kind of raises one of the other things I'm thinking about, and it's just like, would that be possible? course. I'm not gonna worry about that right now. Maybe it's not giving me any because I don't know what those are yet. Maybe. It's probably why I'm getting rupees instead. Otherwise it's on the other side, I believe. No. I mean, I could also do the... to get the item from him. I'll go to 20 bombs and that's it. There we go. 
Just gonna skip over most of this text. Mostly because... Water Temple contains the emerald. Okay. I mean, that's not bad information to know. I think I'll cut out most of that random bomb thing. And it's just like, okay, that never happened. There's no rupees in here. I feel cheated. Actually, there's nothing in the village anymore. All right, I'm out of here. To the forest. Hopefully I can find some nice song for the forest too. Oh, this is gonna be difficult. Of course, that's out because I know the bright spots are like, yeah, that's how you leave the forest. All right, hopefully less depth this time. Thank you. We get sticks. Zelda's Lullaby, which is really important. And then we go to Zora's River. Must do this quickly. I think I'll, like, also call it after that point. Technically, we've done two episodes worth of work. Well. I'm avoiding the archery minigame on purpose, for now. We did bombs to at least get this far. Otherwise. One of the heart piece blue piece. We're gonna totally ignore it. Even though I think I can grab it with the like the hook shot. And this is this grotto. I have no idea what's in this one. Oh, but also kill a spider while I'm here. Like well, kill two spiders. Oh, it's a fairy fountain. Okay, that's nice to know. 
don't have any bottles, so it's collecting a fairy would be a waste for now. And I'm not really low on health either, so... What do you say? Is blueprints. Blueprints for what? Oh, probably a temple map. And you were... Ah, right. So I could go to the forest temple if I really wanted to, but I don't think I'm going to get far in it without any keys. I'm pretty sure I skipped over one of the keys I found previously. Alright, let's see if I can't uh, hookshot this neck. I forgot about the spider. Get the spider quick. Before it turns today. Come on. I don't have the sun song, so it's just like... You're out of luck, buddy. Wahahaha. Gruder's Fortress Key. That's one out of four, I believe. Now, should my, like, sidebar tracker thing also keep track of keys? That's one of the things I'd probably, like, only update once per episode, if anything. And you are... Oh, well, okay, I'm gonna come back for you later. For sure. Oh, it's daytime, so there's no point of doing anything else this episode. So, um, yeah, I'm going to end off things here. So tune in again for more. Hopefully. Because this, this run turned from terrible to actually kind of maybe doable. <laughs>